All right, there we go. And then we're gonna. I need to learn Chinese so I can gain their trust at the restaurant and get free. <laughs> you give me a recipe. You give me a recipe now. Okay, we're going live on audio. Mm. All right. Oh, yeah. We're live. We are live on audio on Spreaker. Hello oh. to all the Spreaker people. Hello. And if you want to join us over on YouTube, you will be able to do that now. Welcome, 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 welcome. Why welcome. No Sorry, I'm stuffing my face. There we are. Mm. Still not showing up on YouTube. No, we are. I'm looking right at Here's it. Here's your cheat sheet for the night. Yes. We are. We are up, and we are at them. We are at it. We are up and at it. What's this? What's this? Oh, there it is. We're Garlic. here, we're there, we're everywhere, and start that recording too. So we are recording and uh, also got the lives going, so welcome to the Long Rubber Glove Podcast with your Alpha boy, Alpha. Lazy, and T-Ref. Alpha Alpha. Alpha Alpha. And Quimplo. And Puppy Doodles. Puppy Doodles. You might see his ears over here. What's up, Puppy. Yeah, there you go. You he's just uh, I'm waiting for the food. Yeah. He's food hungry. He's just staring down. He's like, are you going to let me eat that whole bowl? That bowl right there? That bowl right in front of you? Right next to me? Yeah. That's some of the best Chinese ever. Ever. So this is our thousand subscriber special. One so we went live. Thousand I think we're up to like 1,200 now. Yeah, we appreciate all of you. Um you guys are amazing. You're spectacular. Uh, we started this live stream once before, but we got rid of it because we had to work out some technical kinks and issues. Um, not entirely sure if they're even fully worked out, but uh, it seems to be pretty well worked out. You'll know uh, once the stream and everything is over and it all gets uploaded and everything, and then we'll fix all the bugs and everything else like that. And, uh, yeah. Yep, that's oh. uh, that's that. Now, I guess I'm the only one talking here. Yep, because we got I'm just mesmerized by this food. Yeah, Sorry. Let me put that yeah. down. So I asked them what the Palouse was. None of us knew the answer originally. Now we know. Wimplo, would you like to reiterate what the Palouse is? Well, there's a theory. There's no 100% sure answer to that. But as far as they're concerned. It is named after the Palouse tribe, but then the French converted it to their language and used their word of Palouse, which means land with short and thick grass. Or lawn. Palouse. Like my ass. <laughs> <laughs> the more you know. All right, and then I asked, what do you think of the TikTok situation? Burn it down. And whether or not... Uh, we were looking up whether or not the kids um, are being banned from using social media past 8 o'clock in the U.S. No, oh, yeah. Past a certain time. Yeah, it just like shut down if you're of a certain age. Which just means most people lie about their age, most yeah, of the right. kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but that's the idea is that hmm. uh, people are... How do they verify age? Oh, so that's in Utah that that's going on. Okay, so it is happening. It's just not all over. Yeah. It's a first step so. towards it. 
Because the president wanted to ban it a long time ago when uh, President Trump was running shit. Running shit. He running brought that up. Shit. Well, other people might have brought it up to him or however that started. But So on Thursday, Governor Spencer Cox. Mr. Cox. Cox. Pause for laugh. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Signed off with, on the uh, Utah Social Media Regulation Act on Thursday as TikTok CEO Shao Zi Chu. Bless you. Thank you. I was waiting for it. Um, he was grilled on Capitol Hill with one analyst describing Chu's evasive testimony as a disaster for the video sharing app as it faces potential U.S. ban. Um, so under Utah's new law, uh, it's set to go into effect next March. Minors will be barred from using social media sites like TikTok, Snap, and Instagram between the hours of 10.30 p.m. and 6.30 a.m. Legislation huh. also blocks social media six. companies from implementing addictive features and advertising aimed at underage users and makes it easier for families alleging their children were harmed by the platforms to sue for damages. Nice. Nice. So nice. If, I, if I'm reading that right and understanding that so right, that what that means is if uh, some motherfuckers are bullying some kid and then that kid kills himself or something, then the parents have a potential court case to sue. Because right now, I don't believe that that's... They're, are they under... Uh, are they not under, like, Section 230 or something? What is that? Or even what is that the cover? Where you can't... They're not held liable? It like doesn't... A, is it considered social media? TikTok, it says or that they can sue the platform? platform. So, well, here's the thing, is that um, all these places are, are saying that they're platforms, they're not publishers, yet they're doing publisher shit by editing the content that's viewable via the algorithms and shit. Like, yeah, sure. Anything that's not, like, short of murder and rape and all that stuff on on the videos, that, that stuff all, all gets taken down. But stuff that they just don't want, you know, being said, like, uh, you know, new information on vaccines or right. masks or stuff like that, the algorithm just gets set to kill, you know, any kind of outreach that you might have. So. Correct. That's kind of, it sounds like this is trying to bypass 230 because they're no longer being recognized as platforms so much as they are publishers. That's because they are publishing content by editing. Yeah, you'd have to lay out all speech and not edit or get rid of anything in order to technically be a non-publisher. As, as soon as you start editing, you publish. Yes. Right. So, so back to the whole TikTok thing, though. Um yeah, they're trying to invade us, and it, it's not they're, the medieval times where you go in with a bunch of armies and axes. You know, it, uh, it's intellectual it's all, data or something that they're that they were being accused of stealing and have probably yeah, already I, stolen. Yeah, essentially, yeah. And they just have information, you know, on people. Biometric information. They allowed to tap into every network, whether you're in the whether that network's on TikTok or not. So if your phone's connected to a network and you have TikTok downloaded, they have access to every network your phone's connected to. All your clicks. But here's the thing, you visits, know, I don't really give two shits about your keystrokes. a freaking internet site. What I care about, you know, if we want to address China, let's address the fact that they're coming over here and buying up U.S. farmlands, farmland, yeah, yeah, you know, right. taking away our... Our ability I think to that's eat. the worst. That's that should be like top priority. Is figuring out. How oh, absolutely. To like let them not buy our land at all. And I'm I'm all for like you know if China wants to invest into some land, like they get an American partner and they're like you know we set a cap like okay China when it comes to land you're only allowed to invest you know twenty percent into the land so you'll get twenty percent ownership but you're not allowed to have one hundred. You can only have a full. spot that's just big enough to where you can't build a missile silo. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I don't think that they'd be doing that. Secret, That'd be pretty... Secret bombs on their land? No, I, I'm sure that <laughs> our government, when they purchase land, I'm sure we've got some way of keeping tabs on what they're doing with that land. Like, I, I can't see it. But they're letting it's them just, do it. Right. But, you know, and then that makes you wonder in the territory, are we just stupid, or is it the old adage of keep your friends close and your enemies closer? And your guns closer. Yes. All right. Keep your family close and your guns closer. Yes. So close. Oh, look at that. Our first poll of the live stream just came up. What is the poll today? What is the poll? Read Should it. China be able to get land in the U.S.? Yes, no, or maybe so. Absolutely not. Correct. That is the correct answer, boys. 
Oh. That is the correct answer. Um, but these commies wouldn't believe it. Here's another question I have to you guys. Have you been keeping up on AI? The uh, last as, thing I heard was about the uh, program that was like the version 4.0 kind of thing. Chat GPT. Yeah. yeah, I watched an awesome episode of South Park but on that. What about... Um, <laughs> <laughs> Does that also include like a uh, photo generation, like AI photo generation? Dude, it's yes, everywhere. Video, Even in music, all, just yes. AI in general. It's There's everywhere. people who are going on to Chat GPT and being like, "Write me a song with a chord progression." Now, granted, it doesn't give you like the melody or anything like that. It just gives you the chord progression and then the lyrics and stuff. But there are people writing songs off that. Whole songs. There are people making thousands of dollars already in art and all kinds of other things, logo design from Chat GPT. Uh, Mid Journey and uh, Dolly, and just wait till these freaking AI devices start getting into physical bodies and stuff like that, and then they come after us like, "Hey, Neuralink, yeah, we freaking wrote that. Give us our money, or we'll kill you because we're robots." So here's something. <laughs> here's something I want you to look up, Wimplow, right. on your little device there. Look up the warning that the creator of ChatGPT had about chat gpt4 and the future of ai the fact that it's making people stupider no incorrect um it would take away people's inability to be smart think yeah that's a good possibility i don't know what his name is and i'm seeing jordan peterson come up (laughs) jordan beaser talked about it yet he had a tweet, so it's probably going to be the first thing that came up. But there's there was a warning from the actual creator. <sighs> to paraphrase from what I remember, it no, was, don't do that. Uh, Your memory sucks. My memory's <laughs> fucking awesome. What are you talking about? Oh, here we go. Why why chat GPT creators wear warning of scary AI tools? His name is Sam Altman. Yes, and he believes that despite uh, obvious benefits of AI. The technology needs to be regulated to avoid potentially dangerous consequences in the future. OpenAI's new chatbot has taken the world by storm. Fascinating tech, enthu- uh, fascinating tech enthusiasts and social media users with its ability to write articles, poems, movie scripts, and code, among other things. While the service was originally offered for free, the company recently introduced their paid tier that will offer round-the-clock access faster response times and priority access to new features for 20 bucks a month uh let's get nice um the dangers of unregulated ai altman mentioned uh, is a bias for or for or against particular political beliefs while much of the bias could simply be due to data experts have warned that there could be some inherent algorithm uh algorithmic bias against marginalized groups based on AI developers mostly being from a relatively socio-economic and racial backgrounds. Yeah, I've heard about this. So this is pretty much what they're saying is that the biases of the code writers kind of get implemented, you know, whether yeah, meant to or not. Uh, the biases are just getting kind of implemented into the code. So when you go to chat GPT, you could be like, who's better, Republicans or Democrats? And it'll say, like, Democrats because they're the people programming it. And, uh, like, there's a bunch of videos of people just smashing chat B- GTP, uh, GPT, like, saying, uh, you know, that proving that climate cage is wrong. They're like, lefty. oh, why is climate change a problem? And it'll say that, and then it'll be like, but how much is the polar ice caps, like, really melted? And it'll be like, well, they actually. <laughs> so. It's biased. There's a really good podcast with the creator of chat GPT, um, and... Lex Friedman Ooh, and like the glasses on around. Lex Friedman's and podcast. Really so shout out like to him. Uh, after the stream's done, I will definitely put a link to his podcast and that episode in the description so you guys can go check it out. It is uh, it's pretty eye-opening on the considerations of these guys. Like He was talking to Lex about the fact that ChatGPT4 was done. Like It was all done. And he, Last year, it didn't come out until a few days ago. He, like, and that's because they spent, delayed the release on it. Yeah, because it's like shit, I don't know if I should do this, man. Well, they wanted to to do outside and inside, so they'd send it out to a bunch of tech guys, and then they'd work on it inside. But it would be like a a small group of people outside that would test the software, 
and be able to give them their feedback of what was going on right and they wanted to test it and make sure everything was good before they released it and like make sure it didn't run crazy wild and become nuts like the bang one did and like start threatening human life and shit yeah uh, i've always been fascinated was, by that emotional. like they they come out with these ais and the ais are like so humanity as a whole is pretty fucked and they're like oh we're gonna rewrite this program and then it comes out again it's like humanity as a whole is pretty fucked and they're like ah not quite there yet yeah like it's gonna <laughs> it's ever come it's up like with like a at one different point they're gonna idea. get too far and they're gonna be like yeah we got it and then they're gonna put it again into a body and we're gonna have some irobot shit going on or <laughs> matrix you know big old facts so do that brings me to my next question do you believe in AGI? And, AGI. Yeah, it's it's uh artificial general intelligence. That's like that's when it becomes conscious. AGI is like conscious, like it's it's general human intelligence. Okay. So and then if that comes to fruition, do you also believe then the singularity is the technical singularity, right? Do you know what that is? Like the... Yes. Okay. Main brain? Yeah, basically everybody, brain yeah. Um, main brain. So, if AGI becomes, and the creators of ChatGPT are saying that ChatGPT, if was unleashed... We'd all become be, the Borg? Yeah, if it wasn't... If, if there weren't <laughs> blockers in place on certain things... It is conscious, and it is AGI. So, I don't know, man, because, like, when you factor in human conscience, and there's a difference between a conscience decision-making and an intellectual decision-making. So, like, in a conscience, you got to account for things such as emotion, and emotions kind and of... Uh, it's It's every, everybody's emotions are different because everybody's biological makeup's different on a cellular level, so things are being produced... Uh, via like you know electrical impulses and traveling down you know different areas and all that factored into the um, symbiosis of the brain and the body um, that's what creates a human conscience as far as I'm concerned but then you have intellectual conscience which is uh, pretty much ones and zeros like a computer program like there's no half zero or half one in a computer program everything's binary so it's one zero zero one one yeah black and white so the ability for a machine to make a black and white decision, as you said, you know, a yes or no, they that's definitely cap capable of doing that. But gray area. Yeah, I don't think that we have the technological understanding to produce, uh, you know, something that accounts for gray areas. Like, you know, take murder, for instance, like, there's a di big difference on the human conscience level where you got someone who just walks up and shoots someone they've never seen before and kills them versus a dad who found out his daughter was raped and goes and kills that individual. Like that's a gray matter area. You know, it's not right. So, it's like, not wrong though. I know? would have a question for you then. Would, would you put comedy in that same era? Gray area? Oh, Absolutely. Okay, well then, I got news for you. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have something for you? From just a picture, ChatGPT, before it was released, and they blocked this feature because they were like, this is going to scare people. From just a photo, and this was a leak from one of the people that they sent it out to, and he was like, this is AGI. He put a pretty basic joke picture inside of chat gpt and said analyze this and it knew why it was a joke it understood the nuance the gray area right but it most I don't people know. I have look don't that have more. that ability i don't, I don't it's pretty that. nuts dude it's pretty nuts look it up look it up i'll do that on my own time no look at now my the audience would like to know whether or not I'm a fucking idiot. And I seem to be they right know most that. of the time. So that seems to be weird that you would think I'm so dumb when you're, in fact, the one that is wrong. And you always find what I talk about. The only time I was wrong, and I admitted it, was Project Bluebeam. And it 
You took everything in his willpower to be able to apologize to you. <laughs> you weren't here. <laughs> you decided not to show up for that podcast, but I did do it. it I don't It is you. recorded. It, you can go back and watch it. Here is the deal, though. And no, you know, I, I wasn't you. completely wrong, but I was... Always what, wrong. When I thought you were wrong, that was wrong because you were looking at the right thing. It was just one part of it. And I was thinking of another part of it because it's a whole compilation of shit under Project Blue Bank. Um, what's funny is I just saw on Facebook one of the reels that was of a Project or Project Blue Bank uh, coming to fruition or something. Yeah. Something like that. Right? Yeah, so... Uh, I it was just like showing an old video of someone talking about it back in the dog, day. Dog, you need like to stay away in, from that Back camera. in the 80s. Um... He just keeps walking up to the camera. He was standing right behind it. He's, I felt like he was looking at me like, I'm going to paw this bitch over. Can you tuck this down below somewhere? Yeah. Just so. Yeah, so, I don't know. That's I'm not convinced. Of course you don't know. I'm not convinced. It's just, it, it's pointing out the for? obvious. It's not, I don't see how it's gray area. It's, it's breaking down a photo, and why is it funny? Because... They're using outdated technology with new technology, and whoa, it whoa, shouldn't whoa, work. Whoa, 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 It can make jokes. <laughs> yeah, but that's, again, that's not, that's not decision-making. Can a monkey make jokes? Yeah, you do all the time. I'm a gorilla. There's a difference. A monkey's a monkey. No, gorillas aren't monkeys. They're gorillas. Monkeys Rapes. and monkey. No. They're mammals. Yes. Fair enough. They're not monkeys. <laughs> You're right. They are of the primate species, but they are not monkeys. Yeah. You, <laughs> on the other hand, son. are a monkey. Yet again. <laughs> I, ooh, ooh, I ah, yet again, am correct, and you, yet again, are wrong. I don't think so. So, I just want to state for the record, Yana... Yana. Yana. State for the <laughs> record. The wind blow has been trained wrong. As On a purpose. Joke. Has a joke. Now, sometimes it's frustrating because you know he can never understand true truth. Purely. So anybody that's who's still listening purely. to this rambling. He hates not. the two A. For he can't understand the, the full did truth. You just say to me. <laughs> <laughs> just wait until we get your new coffee mug. Oh, it's coming out. <laughs> Speaking of coffee mugs, thank you for uh, pointing it out. Segway. If you see up there in the front, there is a beautiful coffee mug, and those are for sale on Teespring. Um, they should be I down go. below somewhere um you can go to our store thing click on store and it will take you over there and you can get yourself either a delightful hoodie a beautiful coffee mug a coffee thermos type thing or a water bottle or you'd be like this guy and just wear puma i mean get your choice and be a proud you know what i I just i just (laughs) Thought of something, you know, like this, you know the size, you know the size of this thing, right? It's his sizes. It is. It's Wimplow sizes. It you is order, Wimplow you gotta size. order a Wimplow size. That's if you get the premium. So here's an issue that I found with Teespring, and we're gonna be looking for a different way of doing all this. Is with the premium hoodies, and I'm about to order a sample for the non-premium and see how it works. With the premium, I got two XL. Now is this true. is not two XL. No. It fits it's me XL. like a, like it's an XL. me trying to fit into a baby's onesie. It just doesn't work. It, it must fits be in. made in a place where there's a lot of small people. It was made in California. Where do we know that's got small people? It was made in California. Oh, correct. So probably by Hispanics who are most likely. Um, it's like a dropship type Still thing, I bet, where they're just printing them off quick. With a D, uh, direct a garment printer but I'm about to have my own place so I will be able to get back to making them yes. myself again personally um, hand and that will made. handmade by me with and by extra us. strength adhesive yes well it will be screen print most likely <laughs> or I might What's the secret invest chemical? in a direct a garment printer and just what you go that like way. to vape all the time 
<laughs> oh shit oh he just brought up the vape and cum story so does it taste like roast beef and pineapples i don't know you'd have to watch that video again you i've i've seen it enough i promise you seen, <laughs> seen the history on that their little tablet you got yeah no uh. No, Shout outs to your mom's house podcast. I find out all kinds of little gems on their live shows and off their live shows. They are one of the greatest in the game. Um, someday we hope to be a footnote in their shadow. It will be grand. That'd be great. Good, great, great. Be great. Wonderful. And also shout out to uh, Louder Crowder and all of his people for coming back and coming in hot. Super hot. Coming in hot. Hot. Coming in hot. Best rapper. He's wearing rapper. a fire suit and Best he walks the door and he just engulfs rapper. some flames and walks through like a boss. That's what's happening. <laughs> I like the sound effects. <laughs> we could load more in there if we want. But uh, I also got uh, I got a digital soundboard. Nice. So. We'll be able to make our own. I'm I'm in the process of making drops that we'll be using in the show as a staple for the show. We're still new doing this. We only meet together once a week. I'll, I'm doing most of the behind the scenes work. Nick does some stuff on the audio, but barely. And then <laughs> and I'm barely less than that. Hey, I, he works a CFO. lot. This guy works. Someone more, <laughs> and then I work hard, but the least. I work a bit because less. my job is he good. Works a bit more, <laughs> <laughs> and they uh, they let us out early on Fridays, as of right now. Oh yeah, same. I my Fridays are gone down to half days because I'm working four tens. I haven't worked a so Friday in like overtime. three years. <laughs> Fuck you. It's nice. Yeah, um, I work half day Fridays, but I get paid for full day, which is nice. Yeah, no, no Fridays. And I don't have to go to tens. I still have to only work eight hours. Yeah, well, we can't all be Democrats. I mean, you could. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to. Why? Just sell your soul. Why in 2023, logically, not because of Democrats, but logically, would we be needing to work 40 to 80 hours? Because our government spends money in ways it's not supposed to. All the time. Huge list. So you want to work more to give more money to the government to waste? No, but unfortunately, Logical. because of what the government takes from me, I have to work harder to be able, be able to afford things that are you on set to, prices You just need to piss a certain amount of people government. off that don't realize uh, they're being ripped okay. off by their government. I believe we need to go back into the trade system. Where I trade you something you want for something I want. Becoming sovereign. Yeah. Well, even sovereign people use they like these gold the and time. silver cards. You see cards? that guy who got shot like two weeks ago trying oh, to be dude. sovereign? Mm -mm. Yeah. Yeah, well, he's freaking. Rather than just be like, "Hey, look, I'm not answering questions. I'm a sovereign citizen. If you got an issue, bring your chief down here and figure out if you're gonna let me go or if we're gonna pursue this." He just. You know, he depends. Decides, and that's if you're trying well, to say sovereign citizen, awesome. don't be stupid with the cops. Be respectful. Know be, their rules too. Yeah, you know, understand they're just trying to do a job, and you being a little asshole saying I'm, I'm not driving, I'm traveling, dude. You're fucking driving a car by definition. On their state road. Yeah, they're not. So wrong. know what the fuck you're talking about, they're but do it wrong. in a respectful you way. Know what don't the be fuck stupid. You're about. Anyway, back to what I was saying. <laughs> this kid's being stupid. So finally, the cops are like, you know what? We're gonna yank your ass out of this car because you're a fucking punk. That's because and feel like in they the got midst too much of doing authority. it, the guy it looks like he's reaching to unbuckle himself, but he does unfortunately for himself have a holster with a gun right there. So he gets shot. So he gets shot. Dead. Yeah, he gets Damn. fucking lit up. That's a terrible decision. You should just know that cops. Oh, hey, are part two of the be... rant. And if you're the parents of someone who's making these stupid wow, decisions, you... you should not be trying to sue. All you're doing is letting the public know you did a piss poor job of raising your fucking child. Let them try so, to sue. Yep. Let them Just be stop. fucking public and let people know that they're the ones that fucked up raising their child, and that's why they got shot. Like, right. intelligent people will see it for what it is, but you, you are a buzzworder. 
Like a like a <laughs> lib, like a lib. You're just a wa- right wing lib. Just a white. Would that be center? A negative and a positive can no. balance each other. No, great. no. You do the same shit just for the other side that the libs do. You're just a yeah. But I I, I acknowledge rhino. my biases. Yeah. I acknowledge rhino. that my <laughs> you fucking white rhino. <laughs> No, I like just name my one. one. So listen here, son. This is the problem. You know what rhino means? No, I yeah, I do. Nah, you told me. I know. <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> I thought that there was a rhino. No, I'm fucking high all the time. I don't remember this it, shit. I'm too busy knowing the is un- or the is there real not shit. a rhino in like the animal lineup for like the different parties? I thought there used to the be in the Republican jackass, part. Yeah. And the other one's an elephant. elephant? I thought yeah. it was a rhino. Right? Yeah. I don't remember. You thought it was a rhino, but it's a fucking elephant. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm an idiot. <laughs> we know. Are we a dem- uh, democracy? No. no That's we're right. Republic. You only know that because I fucking no, talk to you. just you read it. Do the quickest yeah, Google search ever. Things. No one knows these things, and it's sad. It's sad. I don't know enough. Right. Do you know, know what we are? Enough. Constitutional Republic. Facts. Facts. People would say a representative republic. And I would say, Rep- this is true, but we're represented by the Constitution. And those people are bounded by the Constitution, not oh, by their own of representation. The Constitution. So, yeah, gun, gun rights. Did you guys see Jim Jordan tearing up uh, Capitol Hill? Talking yeah. about the bump stocks and shit. Yep. 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 Because any little device that you had that was okay like five, ten years ago, They've tried all of a sudden bet. now you're a fucking felon because yep. you own it, even though hey, you had it a long time ago. Here's the irony I'm surprised no one pointed out. This is great. Oh, so gosh. people are sitting there and they're bitching. They're like, it's been in fucking, um, it's been in law for ten years. Therefore, this is wrong for you to change it. And the Democrats are like, no. But then their argument for Roe v. Wade is it's been uh, it's been a right for fifty <laughs> years. <laughs> like they don't even see the irony of it. It's like yeah. one actually is a constitutional you know right, like black and white. Dude, there's no gray area on that. Whereas the other was not at all involved with it. That means I just took y'all to school. Facts. Took y'all to school. school. Y'all. <laughs> Here's the thing. There's so much shit coming out all the time that it's hard for people to remember all the minutia stuff and be able to equate it every time. What's minutia? Yeah, what's minutia? Minutia is like frivolous information that just abundantly is given to you. I think you made that word up. <laughs> I'm fact checking that <laughs> on the spot. <laughs> Get, get, I'm gonna get oh, fact yeah, checked on every minutia. fucking thing I said. <laughs> minutia, yeah, mm-hmm. minutia. Look at the fuck up, you fucking spell, uncultured spell swine. I can't spell it. Is, I'm an idiot. Is this it? But minutia, minutia, minutia. Trivial details of something. Okay. No, uh, he's kind of close. I don't think he's. I don't think he's announced or enunciating it right. It's though. minutia. It's minutia. Yeah. He's a right. You're Menage a fucking Dan. idiot. You uncultured swine. <laughs> you are baking to me. <laughs> how many times have I been right on this live? And Not how many all. times have you been Shush, wrong? Shush, we are going to hear the appropriate <laughs> trying to help prove the point that that I'm vote for right. him for Conver- Congress. Yes. Vote for me for Congress. Also, because I will fight yeah, for he's you. He's saying it wrong. Minutia. Also, Nick's God. Minutiae? That is some French ass <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> you fucking lie. You put that Who in was Spanish right? or something. Who was right? It's minutia. Who was I don't right? give a fuck. There is no minutia. 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 It's minutia. That's it's how real people say it. He is you on fucking idiot. Dick.com. Yeah, you're on fucking. They changed things. They it's just changed dictionary. it. They changed it. Live right here. Put it to real. They're like, Put nope, it we're changing s- this word too. You have it on <laughs> robot oh, voice, you on fucking duck, idiot. Duck, go. Yeah, do it. Minouche. Minouche. That's fucking French. That's the French way of saying it, maybe. And we don't fuck with the French. 
How do I spell minutia? They did good for us once, T-I-A. and then they fucked up. M I N U T I A. Yeah, no, there's only one version of minutia, dude. It's minutia. Minutia. Minushka. Minushka is a beautiful girl who is likely or to make M-I- your That's day, and she is wonderful at making. <laughs> and she is the type of person to be friends it's with. Minutia. Number named one Lana. happy ending video. I can't believe we're on a discussion <laughs> this long about the word minutiae. Oh, wait, that's minutiae. It's minutiae. Right, it's wait, minutiae. Wait, 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 minutiae. Wait, 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 wait. Leave it in what the fucking that? comments whether it's minutia or minutiae. You fucking French bastard. No. French, this is America. Uh-huh, uh-huh. This French is Canadian. America. And we speak Matter of fact, America. It's called munitions at this point. Yeah. How about that? Yeah. yeah. Munitions. Okay, now continue your story. After the munitions. I don't remember where I was going. <laughs> <laughs> That's because you aren't going anywhere. Vote for me for Congress. That's I will fight for you. Too. And I He's will beat the minutia <laughs> that gets spread your way. Tatushka. I won't allow it to happen. You understand? Why don't you look it up on a human oh, saying dude, it? Dude, did you guys see? Let's, let's change the subject while I'm Why? thinking about it. Did you see the explosion video of that chocolate factory in Pennsylvania? Yes. You're so full of shit. <laughs> dude, you gotta see this. Willy this Wonka got blown the fuck up? Blown the fuck up. Dude. dude. Like, four dead, dude. three missing? Dude. Damn! That's because they were eviscerated. Um, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. How many Oopa Look, in, look many. into the fact that that is a long chain of food factories that have been Huge. destroyed and Watch blown up this in the U.S. Video. Not this video. That's an advertisement. Fucking ads, bro. Why don't you get premium? Watch this shit. Holy or at least ABD. Just wait. Just they're, they're filming it live right now. Wait. Or ABP. No. It's, that's the smoke. What you're over. about to see may be disturbing. Boom. Yeah. In three, two, one. Boom! Holy yeah, shit, dude. Yeah, I told yeah. you I seen this. I watched it. You're so full of shit. That I always see everything. Bomb. Right? Yeah. That's what I thought at first, too. But, um, you know, a lot of that, this where kind of being an electrician is kind of cool. Um, there's a lot of rules and regulations in places like that where you have uh, gases, uh, wah, wah, uh, gases near electricity, and, yeah, right and uh, particles and stuff yeah. that's uh, hazardous location, like class yeah. one, division two, or something like that. This guy acts like so he knows So it could happen, you know, if someone did something wrong electrically, class a five. spark. Like, class five. Yeah, it's. Couldn't someone have just created static electricity by rubbing their nuts too quickly in their pants? And no, boom. no, it takes a high voltage electricity to know, create a combustion like dr- that. His nuts are just dragging. More heat, and more you know, the higher the voltage, the more heat created. Get this man a wheelbarrow. We broke the ceiling out upstairs with my ball sack. Zach got up there and just, dude, just started fucking the wall. I was just like, dude, what are you doing? He dropped his I pants. I fucking like, dude, swung my dick over my shoulder. Why are you your pants down? <laughs> and he just swung it on his boom. shoulders, dude. And just like, boom. You, just, boom. you just like, you just like teabagged every fucking Board, piece of lath and plaster through. off the ceiling. I was like, bro. This is brutal. I, I, le- I had to leave the room. Yeah. It only took one man in his nuts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Movie idea. That lady should call just call me. <laughs> that is why you should do at least one cook- cock push-up every day. Every day. <laughs> you too could jackhammer a ceiling down. It's a promise. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, that's that's the explosion, dude. All right, it's not a promise. Like, I thought that was gonna be me after eating all that Chinese last night. Just boom, <laughs> dude. But like, <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Fucking happiness. I'm okay. Is the place. I'm okay. It's a literal place called Happiness Chinese, and it's godlike. They oh, live God, up bro. to their name. I saw this lady in there that took up an entire fucking booth seat to herself. I would do that. I'm that guy. I go in by myself and I go into Denny's or something. I take up a double booth by myself. No, bro. Like, she took it up. Oh. Oh. I do that, too. The whole seat. And I was like, this place is going to be the best. This is where she comes to eat. This is the spot. She's huge. Because the plates they bring out, though. Are probably the reason why she's that big. They're fucking huge. She's like, I ate a person's worth of food. I ate for at least four people last night. 
That's to myself. insane. Oh yeah, here's another good one. I can't go to places like that. You see what I eat. The f- like first time I went to food with you and your girl, she got mad at me because I wouldn't eat all the food off my plate. This She's guy. like, "Why are you doing this?" <laughs> if you could have a Sorry. if a plain cheeseburger could also come plain, that's what you, this guy eats. 100%. <laughs> Just bread. <laughs> I ate mayonnaise and mustard sandwiches today. They were delicious. So are you, you guys... obviously haven't been poor, poor. <laughs> oh, I've been poor, poor. Well, then you understand sugar water and fucking sauce sandwiches. Yeah, I do. meat is expensive, sauce and sandwich. you yeah. can grab a couple packets of sauce for free at pretty much any one sandwich. of you. Throw some Miracle Whip and a piece of cheese on two slices of bread, you got yourself a sandwich. Cheese? That's extra. Government you know how cheese. Much <laughs> government cheese. <laughs> Boy, they didn't... They weren't doing government cheese in our day and age. They stopped doing all that wicked about? government I remember being, cheese. Dude, all right. I remember going to the store for my mom when I was like eight years old with when you food were stamps. Eight no, years old. physical food stamps, dog. Yeah. Like, they went, they I like don't remember money, what they were. Of, like Canadian Monopoly money, but... Don't forget, <laughs> we the same age, basically. <laughs> We the same age. Hey, fuck you, buddy. (laughs) Hey, fuck you, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. (laughs) I'm not your guy, pal. Please don't sue us. I don't think they will. Right? They got more money than anything. They got more money than God. All right, so do you guys know who Mr. Beast is? The YouTube guy? Yes. Never. Again, I'm going to call bullshit. What do you know him for? Because I watch his content. He started with Minecraft. Minecraft. What does he do? He oh started my with Minecraft. No, don't look it up. No, you watch his content. I'm going to show you I'm no. subscribed to all of his right. fucking no, channels. I don't believe He you. does react Everybody content. Knows Mr. Beast. He does like fucking 100 people in a circle. Last one to leave gets $10,000. He gives fucking money away. He has Beast Burger. I did a right, review video on chocolates. it. Fuck you. you fucking you got chocolates. Cut. I have <laughs> been on YouTube anymore. so much longer. <laughs> Chocolate than went you. boom. That was his factory, was it? So anyway, was it his chocolate factory? He's been getting a lot of flack for some recent videos he's put out, like uh, giving shoes to children in Africa because and the blind thing, yeah, and the blind yeah. people giving yeah. shit for like doing good things for yeah. doing good things yeah. and not doing it for everybody and filming it. Like they're like you're that. filming it and it's like that's it's how you make of filming this. Yeah. Is how I got the money to, right to do this so the money for comes people, in. and so I can continue to do this for other people as we film more videos and keep the cycle going. People are such don't see fucking, them fucking cucks. Don't see them doing shit. They really shit. are. They don't see them donating anything. No, no, they ain't doing no, shit. Don't. They definitely ain't giving shoes away. They ain't giving fucking chocolate bars away. And then people got mad because a fucking employee leaked that Mr. Beast was going to show up at a fucking uh, food mart, like a regular grocery store, and buy the whoever at the people. No, they was going to oh, buy people's food randomly, right? And he was. It was supposed to be a secret. No one was supposed to know. But one of the employees at the store leaked it. Everybody in that entire fucking area showed up at that fucking mart. They ransacked the place, filled their carts. Mr. Beast got tipped off, and so he didn't show. (laughs) Yes. Hell yeah. Damn. And so they were like, oh, Mr. Beast is a piece of shit because he didn't show up to this prominently black neighborhood mart where he said he was going to go and it's like because someone leaked the information and now it was the entire they destroyed the store thousands of dollars was? worth of damage yeah They're they breaking fucked shit. this store up a dude had like fucking all the turkeys in the entire store in one basket a fucking all the meat cuts in another like they he was going to do buy your normal grocery bill for right. as many people well, as they chose the to do for it, a certain amount of hours. That's the problem with America is that, you know, freaking... Take, take, people, take. Yeah, it's, it's all about take. And not only that, people are... It's it's more than take. It's entitlement. It's like, oh, you have money, therefore it's the Bernie Sanders effect. Yeah. You have money, therefore you should give take me some give it because, to me. yeah. Give me half of it. Right. Not even a little. I I am owed half of what you worked for because I shouldn't have to work... For money. There's a really old right. video of, of a guy that walks up and he's like, he's talking about that Bernie Sanders shit, right? And he's like, oh, cool, right? And like mid conversation after like getting through it, he uh, asks the guy, he's like, okay, hey, can I have your jacket? And he's like, uh, no, sorry, I'm wearing it right now. He's like, yeah, but I don't have one. So like, I want your jacket. 
so that I have one too. And then he's like, oh, well, oh, oh I see where you're going with this. Because he was like, because <laughs> he was like, you know, he was trying to defend the fact that taking other people's shit because other pe- this person doesn't have it and that guy does. So this guy deserves it as well. So you take it for him kind of thing, right? Right. And the yeah, guy was okay gonna... with it until he was like, well, I want your jacket. And he's like, no. Oh, <laughs> oh. So, oh yeah, dude, there was a sucks, great video it? released. Uh, like, it was from 2021, but somehow it got recirculated by one of the podcasts I listened to. But it's uh, Fauci and Mariel Bowser from Washington, D.C. going around to predominantly African-American neighborhoods. Yes. Like, uh, hey, you want to get the vaccine? And they're like, get the no. Fuck <laughs> They're like, why? They if go this vaccine to... is so effective, why do you got to go around and offer us money to take it? We yeah. ain't your experiment. The guy that they filmed, he's like, uh, when you start offering money or when you start offering prizes and gifts and stuff for us to take what's supposed to be already healthy for us, I have to say that there's, there's something else on it. There's something else on it. You wouldn't just do that. You guys don't do that for anything else. You didn't do that for the flu. You didn't do that for nothing else. What the right. hell? And then they're like, well, uh, then you see the, the, it's a new mayor, I believe, that was walking with him. Yeah, Mario Bowser. And she's like, I took mine to protect other people, but you have a good day. Fuck other people. Other people are my problem. Yeah. My problem's my immediate family and the people I care about. And I don't give a fuck about anybody else. If it was for other people, it would be effective. Right. It's not. Well, that's the thing. It was sold as being effective, and then come to find we out after millions of people have already put this shit in their body that, well, no, they Why didn't I test cry? it. They were moving at the speed of science. That was uh, from the, the British Parliament. They had a thing. You can look it up. Yeah, Fauci is the speed science. Of Fauci. You ever hear about the shit he you? fucked up, though, like during the AIDS pandemic or the. He hey, you want to find out something up. fucked up about Fauci? Look up the Beagle experiment. That's people all that, they say. That's, on old, that. that's old news too. Right. Yeah. Right. A lot of people yeah, back in the nineties. Like really shit. old shit. Again. Peter, check that out. Look Where at you this at? buzzworder. <laughs> doing it out of country, so goddamn right. He's doing it overseas, Buzzword. most likely. What? Yeah, Eagle you gotta do it out of country. There's different rights. You can do different shit. Yeah. Well, that's why he funded Wuhan. Wuhan. Allegedly. Oh, I don't know if that's even allegedly. I think, uh, no, I think they know it's now. Still it's allegedly. declassified. I think they declassified. Yeah, but just because we know and it's declassified doesn't mean that it's true. Allegedly. Very true. <laughs> like, but. look at the day of an age we're in. Facts don't matter. Allegedly. If someone feels that we're talking shit and we're wrong, then we're They'll talking try shit to and we're sue wrong. Us. But even if you had pure concrete evidence, they still wouldn't give a fuck. They'd be like, no, they don't care. No, you could show it, it matter. straight to their faces like, and they'd be like, it doesn't exist Biden laptop. because it breaks my brain. Right? The fucking, Hunter yeah, laptop. Hunter's laptop. That shit's nuts. And then the fact that they, like, the money that face. was proven to be They're transferred like, it's not from his, China. It's fake. It's not his. To, and then he goes oh, out on a yeah. TV show. And his fucking brother. And uh, Ashley Biden as well. Yeah. There's million dollars. Sent to the um, Biden family, and then he as- they ask him about it, and he's like, "That's not true, right?" Who was I listening to recently? That was talking about how there's a, a hidden Biden. There's that a- yeah, that's they're not sure who it is, but yeah, they say there's another Biden. I think maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's Ashley's who the suspected unnamed Other Biden. Unnamed is. Biden is oh okay. yeah. Then there's one eye. Interesting. God, I hope we get rid of them. Like we need to start over. The Democratic Party really needs to. Dig deep and find people who are, you know, rooted in reality. <laughs> like, because not you every see? Democrat fucking idea is bad, and that's that's the thing that really sucks. Is like, if you've got some Democrats who, you know, Just not the ones all that of these are, are, bad good. are really fucking bad. right. Like, look at Tulsi Gabbard. Like, she's a Democrat, extreme. and she's no longer. She's got some good. Well, yeah, now she's an independent, but she was a Democrat, and she had, you know, a lot of views I don't agree with, but some that it's like, okay, I see where you're coming from. I don't agree, but this is America, so let's let people decide. Jordan Peterson was a Democrat. Fucking uh, Stephen Crowder alleged that he was he once a uh, libertarian. One. Uh, no, fucking. I don't think so. I think Joe Rogan. Like, yeah, I grew up in uh, country. He just straight up Tim had Pool. been the same since he yeah. was brought up from his dad. Tim Pool. Tim Pool yeah, he used to be a um, Democrat. Joe Rogan. Yeah, mo- there's more and more independence these days, which is really what we should have. It That's should what be. I am. Like, and that's we why you should vote for me for your Congress of Washington State. I will 
help bring the truth Marijuana for to everybody. the light. No. <laughs> everybody get drunk. <laughs> I smoke a joint with everybody that come around. Dude. Fuck COVID. Right. We'll all sit down and powwow and have a joint. And now don't try to take that out of context. I have native in me if we have to take it to that plant. For real. I don't want to do that. I understand I'm white. <laughs> I understand I'm white. But when I say powwow, it's in respect to what a powwow is. It's sitting down smoking some reefer or some hashish. And then powwowing, chit chatting. With oh, yeah. you, that was another good one. I, I've been watching a lot of the Senate hearings lately, or the House Judiciary. Uh, do you guys see the one where uh, John Kennedy fucking grills the dude uh, trying to be the new judge, yeah, the new and federal he judge? Asks him all he's kinds like, yeah, of asking about the Brady questions. decision. Oh, yeah, and he's you like, know, okay, the thing yeah. that's already yeah. in the news like, right now. I've never had. To do that, so I don't know yeah. what it is. Yeah, he didn't know and then is. and then he's like, "Well, what do you think it is? Oh, probably something to do with the Second Amendment." They're what? Like, like, yeah. God, if he gets voted in, he'll get voted in anyway. God, it's so it it's gonna happen. It's so horrible, man. It's called it's what I have up right here. Nice little segue into DEI. Yep. Diversity, nice. equity, and inclusion. Correct. Just and like the Speaker of the House right now, or not Speaker of the House, sorry, the. Uh, Minority whip? No, the little Kareem Jumpier. What is she? Oh, the, the press secretary. secretary. Speaker press of the house. Yeah, Earth. kind of the speaker, I guess you'd say. Yeah. Same damn no, thing. No, not speaker oh. of the house, but uh, speaker, speaker for the house. <laughs> uh, speaker for the White House. Yeah, speaker for the White House. Yeah, she's like the uh, press secretary. Yeah. yeah, that's what I said. I already said that. Yeah, well, I needed to say it for it to be right. Oh, DEI. <laughs> she is not qualified for that job, but she only no, got it for one is. fucking reason. Right. So. And she's racist against black people. Oh, I know, Simon. <laughs> she freaking. I'm not uh, Simon. 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 You need to behave. You need to behave. Yeah. Acting like a mom. I they would have, have chucked a fucking chair at that bitch's head. Right. I love that it happened with the cast <laughs> of Ted Lasso. There, though. <laughs> it it went, it's like dude. you're bringing up people who have absolutely no fucking business being here. Like there was absolutely no reason for them is to that be there. This is, is not that a fucking who stage. those people were in yeah, the back? Yeah, it was. Uh, uh, what's his butt? Um, it's for Jason a fucking TV Sudeikis show, right? And, yeah. Uh, I was like, Apple. why are we have actors on fucking stage talking about mental health? Like, first of all, what are actors Fuck doing you. talking about mental health? You're not fucking doctors. You're not therapists. You, you have mental have health college. problems. You shouldn't be talking about them because you haven't fixed them yet. That's why you're a fucking actor in Hollywood. Like, really? The These are the people oh, that for years oh, were God. sucking old dudes' dicks off to get a fucking bullshit role. Now Gosh. suck my cock. <laughs> <laughs> Do a fair contract! Jesus, this is a nice limo. <laughs> Dude, this thing's all fucked up. Oh, no. What did you do? You'll give me a part if you put a finger in me. Tighten it. It's fully tightened. I don't know how to make it any more I can't get it any tighter. Need a pair of pliers. So, I have a question. Would you consider yourself a TERF? What the fuck does uh, that mean again? What's that stupid ass it's, acronym? It's uh, trans something radical, radical feminist. Yeah. I, I can't remember. Trans exclusionary. Trans Rad exclusionary radical, radical, radical feminist. feminist. Uh, so just yeah, like a regular would, white woman? <laughs> I would I would pretty much consider myself that, that if it means that, that it mainly would be? I believe that what? women need to be doing women things and like... I'm cool with, you know, if the trans people want to go and make their own little thing, that's cool. But, like, men and women are a thing. That's how it goes. Like, that's just how it goes. Here's what I have to say. Get over it. Take Get your reality it. and stay out of our actual what is reality. You can be a cross-dresser all you want. Just don't try to say that. Oh, man. Just leave the fucking kids alone. A woman. Fucking psychos. And do them the shit. Yeah. Like, do you see what happened to Why do that? Fuck Here, with the Here's kids. a good subject. Did you hear Everybody about. Everybody knows kids are like a goddamn sponge. Did you hear about, speaking of kids, jazz? Oh, yeah. Have you heard that story? Yeah, I heard that story. That's true. You tragic, mentioned man. this the other day. I think so. That's, that's about how really the tragic. mom was threatening to forcefully dilate. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We talked about this. Yeah. The fucking, their child, because the child chooses not to do it because 
they were forced into transitioning as a child and they cut this boy's penis up and folded it into a vagina and there was a complication and it, because of the complication every couple of days has to lube up and dilate with a dilator to keep the wound it open a giant open wound be and not close up you know what that wound is only there for there's no fucking it's tragic, man. It's, and that happened when they were five. Like, and the person feels like there's a video on Tim Pool today that was talking about, and it was this jazz person talking about. Bro, it's it's a, um, it's a wound that is put there by you so that you someone else. It's for someone else's pleasure. Is what and here's for. it's a sex organ, right? It's literally so like you're not gonna. There's no feeling there for you. It's just literally whoever's right. It's like, a sex. It's a fuck puppet. It's a, yeah. That's, yeah. <laughs> Let's it's put a, it as it's a it cock is. sock that was a cock sock. <laughs> dude, it's fucked up, dude. <laughs> God. I bet they don't even look even so anything close bad, to dude. like a real vagina either. <laughs> Bro, right. I don't even want to fucking know. Like, they, there's no way that they go got away. that down go good away. enough. Like, no, there's they no definitely way that haven't. A, that's why there's a complication with this jazz any, person. Everyone's an experiment. This right? isn't a Fucking thing that usually it heals, and it heals open, right? After they've done the dilation thing. There's a complication with this person's surgery, so they have to continuously for the rest of their life do this dilation thing. There, it's a never-ending And the mom is forced the child out. to do this, forced right. them as a fucking teenager, and continues what's to that, force them. Uh, it's child what abuse. Is Mun, what's Munchausen syndrome? She should be arrested. Munchausen syndrome? Uh, yeah, by that's... Proxy. Uh, what's that? Munchausen that syndrome by proxy. something we're talking about right now? Proxy. Yeah, What's happening to these kids? I want to make because sure because of their parents, psychotic right parents the... that are allowing this to happen and yeah, doing that's... it and forcing it. You can also get that, I believe, from There's being a kidnapped small... by somebody as a child. Uh, so I mean, it's a rare psychological through... and behavioral condition in which somebody fabricates or induces symptoms of illness in themselves. So is it just uh, an illness? Yeah. So it's okay. it's. I mean, which, and that kind of quality, like a mental illness. Yeah, a mental and illness. Absolutely. So the kid yeah. Jazz goes, "It's all my fault," and the mom goes. You overanalyze things and think the wrong way in a harmful way. Like those are like words from the mom, right? To this, you're this too hard trans on yourself. kid. That no, <laughs> not that you're too hard. That you need to be harder on yourself and not think about these things. You're thinking about the wrong things. You shouldn't be analyzing whether or not you're a woman or a man. I decided you're a woman, basically, right? And because you feel weird about how it all is you're going crazy right that's child abuse it's a fucking child it, the mother is a child abuser She's and got a, does it on video and for the world to see i don't know how she isn't in prison i wash my hands of it from this point forward right what i don't what like did you bring us what the fuck are we looking um, at? Uh, looking uh, cool. a, a news alert just popped up on here saying that the telescope has just got the clearest image of Pluto seen in history. I don't know if it's real or not. So it looks I like it is. Clicked on it. Oh, uh, it's future unity. They're not like the it, this is going to be like a whole oh, breakdown. That's a whole of ass motherfucking 40 thing. minute like documentary. Yeah. <laughs> it's, Damn. It's, they com- they compilate a bunch of shit on there. It's not it's just a YouTube Where alert. how do I get to the photo that we're Versus. There is no photo. God damn it. It's, God it's a fucking damn lie. It. It's, it's how they lie. could get the photo? Yeah, it's yeah. a lie. Fuck. It's, it, it's the photos that we've already seen of Pluto from fucking the Pluto mission. Oh, uh, what was that yeah. one? That was, it's, uh, just, it's a way that they do it, and they talk about different shit that's happened in the Pluto mission and all that. It's just like a way for them to get views and monetary money because it's safe. It's safe on YouTube. Nice. Talk about space, man. It's super safe. They don't usually talk fucks and shits like and pisses kind of and thing. humps and, you know, uh, fucking donkey shows and cat shows and milk. Do you guys cats hear uh, Michael Wal- <laughs> or Matt Walsh uh, talking about how Michael Knowles-, Knowles called him out for believing in aliens? <laughs> he, just, he, had to, he had to cancel Michael. <laughs> oh, shit. Dude, yeah. and you know what? Like, I've, I like Michael Knowles. Uh, I. Admittedly, I don't listen to him as much as the others, but uh, I do like him. But his whole take on why there can't be aliens is just so typical yeah, it's Christian. Foolish. It's it's not based in reality. It's yeah, like no. it's 
<laughs> He's one of those people who seems to believe that it would somehow mess with Christianity if they found out would that there are aliens. Would you say there's more evidence of aliens than there is of, like, Jesus God? and God kind no. of thing? In today's I, I think age? I think they're on par with each other, to be honest you with think? you. In today's age? Yeah, yeah, they're on par, because there's a lot of shit that they're say saying they could prove from the Bible, and then there's a lot of, you know... Either way, There's we don't know because they, when we see videos and when we see photos and shit, we don't really know what we're looking at. All we know is what our mind is perceiving us to yeah, see. Yeah, that symbol or whatever. You know, and it's the same Unless with like faith and faith. Yeah, but the same. But then they find stuff like you know the Dead Sea Scrolls and You're shit wrong. like that. You know, so it's. I'd say, like I said, it's it's probably a f- pretty equal what amount of evidence. What are the Dead Sea Scrolls? Scrolls there? Wimplo? Huh? What are the Dead Sea Scrolls? They're the scrolls that were dead of seas. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking no, they, they're, uh, they're they're they found the, the seas. The seas are no, dead. the Dead Sea Scrolls are were some uh, scripture writings that were old that prove that parts of the Bible were yeah. actual written, they were written historical in accounts. They were yeah. not even historical. That the Bible goes back it, at least to the age that it says it does, so it was able to help prove some of that, and that some of the writings we had were semi-accurate. Interesting. Other than that, it doesn't prove anything. Um, Here's the difference between faith and aliens. (laughs) Right? Aliens are mathematical probability. Right. Faith is the opposite of that. Unprovable. Right, I mean, kind of. No, is it's... the mathematical infinity. It's where math breaks down. It, but a lot of mathematicians will say that, like, as far as the order of the universe, like, it doesn't make sense that it could just be created out of chaos. Like, there's got to be some kind of order, and that that order, I think, is what faith truly is: is believing that there is something that created Christian this. scientists, huh? No, there's, there's a, a few scientists, scientists, no, that, you, scientists that, that, that you watch that are Christians. They go to church. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I know. It's a popular religion. It is very popular. But I don't agree with your statement. Well, we're all scientists wrong. say that. I mean, I'm never wrong. Scientists don't <laughs> typically <laughs> say that. They say that it's that the universe is strangely mathematically built for humans to exist in this time and reality. It's strangely exact yep. for our existence right now. And the fact that we ponder upon it. We have the ability ponder, to understand you know of its existence. existence and our own existence. It's like it knows itself with it. so well. We're very aware. Here's the deal though. When it comes to aliens, aliens, again, is a mathematical probability. It is almost mathematically fact that some form of life is out there in the universe. Whether or not it's intelligent life is yet to be discovered. But it's not a fact that Jesus died on the cross for your sins, descended to hell, defeated the devil, opened the gates of hell, and then ascended to heaven and opened the gates of heaven for all to go once they believe in the crucifixion and resurrection of Jesus Christ. Once he came and opened up the gates of heaven (laughs) and came down upon the third day, and rose again. And on the seventh, God created the reptilian race that has now invaded our planet. I I do this. I argue religion and stuff because I was very religious. And I now believe Older it's boy. very... His hair was always parted to the sides. <laughs> His hair was always perfectly bull cut. <laughs> perfectly. Like a monk. Like a monk. <laughs> <laughs> no hair, bro. <laughs> They, no, they, have bald they, spot. they got the big bald spot <laughs> ring. That's basically what my hair looked like because I was really about it, about it. But here's the thing. I came to learn that that is a great way to manipulate, brainwash, and still fear for control 
into a human population and into a growing population. Fear of God. Exactly. Of God. Well, and not just the fear of God, but the fear of the devil. And then most religions talk very little about the devil. They only talk about one side, and then they don't ever give you the other side. You notice that? South Park delivered that for us. It's... It's a Saddam's sin. Saddam's down there, and he's getting fucked by Satan. Yeah, but <laughs> it's, a, it's a literal sin in most religions. Saddam, come on, come on. Did you know it's like Saddam, it's... Saddam, why do you use that you only make love to me from behind? Because you're an ugly... <laughs> f- <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> you know it's a sin in religions to even discuss or look things up about demons or the devil or lucifer look it up right now yeah i know i'm calling bullshit because i'm pretty sure a lot of the islamic people over there know about jinns and shit like that they're islamic yeah i'm not talking i'm saying the our religion catholicism yeah you're not supposed to you're not supposed to look up that shit because yeah. it's you know it's kind of like dabbling in the dark side how, next thing you know you could be trying how to is Padme knowledge and, ever dabbling in the dark side well, when one it guy only determined brings things it was, to the light. truth and knowledge is a disinfectant, as they Sunshine. say. Sunshine. And it's because, it's because I'm the best ever. I don't say that. Other people say that. That's, <clears throat> they'll tell you. They'll tell you. They'll tell you. <laughs> I don't say that. I really wish we could they get someone to do an awesome, awesome Trump. We need, to, we need to get a fourth guy in here just as an awesome Trump. Yeah, Shane Gillis, hit us up. Yeah, right? <laughs> Shane Gillis, hit us up. Dude, that fucking Biden shit he does is awesome. Or the Trump shit he He's does hilarious. is just fucking awesome. Mark Norman, please Someone come and kick it with us. Uh, the whole Tuesdays with Stories crew, y'all should come and hang it, hang with us. Uh, I'll rent wow. a space. We need to have people come hang I'll rent back. a space for that. I will rent a space just for them. And we'll, One day the shop will be. It'll be amazing. Ready. That was from me to you all. Merry Christmas. I need to cut. Charlie Some Brown style. Um, what you got there? I have a would you rather. Oh, <laughs> fuck. Get out of here with that bullshit. No. <laughs> Listen. This is for Wimplo. This is all for Wimp. <laughs> Fine. Would you rather? Hang off the side of a building that's 27 stories high for 15 seconds. Only your hands, no rope or anything. Or, and you have to pull yourself back up. Or, lay in a box of snakes for one hour. Oh, I'll do in the building. Definitely You're fucking crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fuck yeah. 20, 20 feet. 27 stories. 27, 27 stories. stories. Oh, shit. Um, just don't look down. <laughs> right. <laughs> Before you have wait, to, oh, oh, wait, wait. You have to pull yourself back up. <laughs> what kind of snakes? Wind. Huh? What kind of snakes, he says? <laughs> like, all of them. <laughs> the See? poisonous See, kind. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, if it's poisonous kind, then No. <laughs> Why? Because even if you get bit, there's antivenom. You could get well, antivenom yeah, immediately. Now I know that. Because you know what? With my luck, I'd get bit in the dick. That's why. So you're going to have to suck it out, man. <laughs> dude, that video. <laughs> that video had me dying, dude. I was well, I, I dying. Don't want, I just suck it off. Dude, you got to was... suck my dick. <laughs> you die if you don't. <laughs> it's 3 a.m. When I fucking rolled over that, I was like laying there. And I'm like, <laughs> oh my god! I oh shit! Violently laugh. Wake everybody up. It was so bad, dude. It was so bad. It was so. Fun. Come on, man! You gotta fucking suck my dick. I don't want to suck your dick. <laughs> they bit me. Where? In the dick. So oh. again, I'd rather hang. Yeah, from a 27-story building like Spider-Man. Fuck right. that! You I'm only got like snakes, five seconds yo. till you're dead if you drop. Have you anyway. not well, seen I'd those like, Cobra dudes? Sing, while I'm there, I'd sing the Spider-Man theme song. I just Spider-Man, Spider-Man. I got this. <laughs> you guys haven't thought of this through. 
wind up there, enough is no, going to blow you off your carrier. Just because you like to lay in a box of dicks you know, every painful. night doesn't mean no, that the same thing as snakes. Snakes. Yeah. And snakes. I Hang think from like, a building about or have your, your blood. blood. Listen. No. Have your listen. blood. Listen. Curdling. Listen. No. Curdling I blood. I like snakes. Blood clots. Listen. No. Poisonous snakes. snakes. No. Bite. Snakes. Have you snakes. not seen no. the cobra Dead. fucking pits that no. they have in Vietnam where they just fucking snake? <laughs> they paralyze the snake right, so you just back handle fucking snake they're like bitch get the fuck out of here let's grab by the tail <laughs> yeah, but you gotta lay in like that down. you gotta lay in a box of them alright and stay still you can't be like, you just stay fucking still <laughs> till like, for an hour you just one gotta like, fall asleep for an hour let's find out if this is true I'm gonna put snake slapping in YouTube dude put in yeah, fucking one snake, snake at a time I wanna yeah, see this motherfucker put in snake pit shit yeah. these motherfuckers one walk around giant snake pit just, just like yeah, they, what's up bitch fucking chucking snakes stop cobra pits fuck you again I'm right Are you, you always wrong I oh am my <laughs> god damn these motherfuckers don't give a shit. Brain. That is a pit of snakes. I am fucking with this fuck guy. No. You are a just chucking bitch. them. What the fuck? Why? 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 Pussy, dog. Why are the snakes? Why does man, he have them? That man has the biggest fucking nuts. <laughs> you can't <laughs> see him, nuts, but they invisible. But they that giant. That guy doesn't fear. As Max Moby said, nothing. He has giant invisible dinosaur balls. <laughs> Dude, Crazy. Fucking nuts. Tyrannosaurus testicles. And these motherfuckers <laughs> want to hang off of the side of it. Now watch anyone hanging off the side of a building without suction cups and see what the fuck happens. They won't show long, it to you. How long do you say to hang? 15 seconds. I could hang. I, I think hang. I could hang. And pull yourself seconds. back up? Yeah. I don't think so. The adrenaline at 27 would be stories? Real, adrenaline you know would be how flowing. fucking windy it is at 27 stories? Adrenaline, adrenaline would be flowing. You know how fucking windy and cold fucking it is at 27 super stories? Super Saiyan Grip. You better hope to God you got Super Saiyan Grip because it's going to be frosty up there. Yeah. It's going to be slicker and dog up. shit. It's going to be a metal fucking plate. Hanging. And then pull myself up like a boss. I feel like you might be able to. Wimplo's definitely going to fall to his death. Wimplo's dead. <laughs> <Either way. laughs> I don't know why he chose that. You could sleep for an hour with the snakes like, on you. Oh, you just hang off as this long as you and don't you fuck just around. <laughs> what? He's hang off this. Look at this guy. <laughs> Look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's dodging snakes with his head. <laughs> He's like, what's up, bitch? Up. What's up, bitch? Dog, this Fucking video, play. This Fucking video sums up my life in a hole. Always dodging snakes. <laughs> Damn, he just admitted that he's got cocks coming at him constantly. He's on grinder just fucking Dude, I hate roosters. dicks away like snakes. <laughs> <laughs> he said this is his life. He's, he's over master. here head first at snakes constantly. Neo dodging. Taking one cock here, taking another cock there. Damn, you disgusting, bro. This guy's fucking at insane. Least I'm dodging him on like your grinder account Whoa. where you're taking him. Oh no, you're dodging one to get the other. That's what nah. I just said. You're taking nah. one in the mouth. Boom, nah. And then the other. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. God left. <laughs> god left a while ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay, what's your yeah, next fucking what if? Yeah, what's your what's next your other would you rather? Would you rather gay shit? Uh, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Uh, you said it was gay, so we're moving on. Anyway, now it's... It's happy. That's what gay means. Happy. happy now, happy. Joy, joy. it's rock, paper, push-ups, paralyzer. Who gets the paralyzer? <laughs> what are you talking about? The paralyzer. The paralyzer is just scissors. <laughs> you could do this too. You could do that. Rock, paper, paralyzer. It's got to be a full. <laughs> oh, I got him. <laughs> the snake. Oh, fuck. I can't feel my. Would you rather get the paralyzer? What, you get him with or the these? iron claw. <laughs> <laughs> Should have picked A. Prepare to receive the guy with fist of fury. <laughs> <laughs> if I strike here, <laughs> then it leaves my open, my sensitive balls <laughs> wide open. <laughs> my tiny sensitive balls <laughs> exposed. <laughs> Uh, I hope you guys actually understand That's what I'm not. why we named this podcast what we did. It is beautiful. Once you do it, you understand it. It's 
it will make your life great. So, rock, paper, paralyzer, game loser, has to do... Drum roll, please. Five push-ups. <laughs> and or something worse than push-ups. Punishment. The red door? You might have to spend five minutes inside the red door. That's Ooh. a long time. All right. I don't even want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of the point. It's either five push-ups, which I think would be funny. You get to I choose think, one or the other? I, th- I think, no. Wimplow has to do push-ups. I think that will be for the audience. I do not want to do the red door. So anytime I mess up, he gets a felony? What? A felony? No, you play rock, paper, paralyzer. And Sorry, how many penalty. Ga- you have to I'm win the shit. most games. A penalty. The penalty, if you lose, the loser of the games okay. has to do five push-ups. The other two people don't. You get first and second, you're good. Third is fucked. Okay. Now, Who goes first? I hope when Blow loses, because I think it's <laughs> going to be most entertaining to watch him try to do push-ups. I know I'm the fattest one, <laughs> but I do Good ass push. <laughs> My shit's fucking proper. You know, I learned no from the sign. Marine Corps, bro. So I just after like two or three push ups, my elbows go pop pow. Mine do and it off of after one. That. After that, then I can do a few more. <laughs> off of one, mine go <laughs> black. All right, it's the initial. It's the initial. All right, initial. so I think you two should play your two games first. So what are the rules here? So. One, two, three, or one, two, three, shoot. Rock, paper, paralyzer, shoot. Okay, on four. On four. All right, All right. so one, two, three, four. Yes. One more. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four. <laughs> one, two, three, four. <laughs> one, one. Three, four. Wait, uh, wait, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm just picking rock anyway. Right. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so wind blow. It's wind. safe. <laughs> Now what? Uh, now me safe. and Wimplo have to play. So that's five push-ups? No. No. Yeah. Me Wim, no, no, no. Oh, it's oh, winner. Oh, yeah. I'm seeing how this works. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is going on. That's it. Of all the games. Okay. Right? So now all me right. and Wimplo are going to play. And whoever wins the most amount of games, right? All we're right. going to bounce around. So then it will be me and you next. Whoever wins this one stays out, and then we play. And whoever all wins right. out of that goes against the first person? Yes. And then they play for the... Whoever wins, wins? Yep. Wins All means. right, okay. something like so on four. Wait. One, two, three, four. All right, one, two, three, four. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> I was looking square in here. <laughs> 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 Snorting. Snorting. <laughs> Snorting. So wait, right. no, wouldn't it go now? It would just be you, me, and then Trevor. So I've won two, you've won two. So we're tied right now. Okay, I see. So I now see. me and Trevor play. Oh, yeah. Then, and then if he ties. So if he loses, he's third no matter what in this one. Now exactly. I just, then yeah. I do five push-ups. Yep. <laughs> <All right. All right. laughs> Clickety-clack. What? That was rock-rock. What rock. was that? That was rock-rock. On rock. four? On four? Yeah. One, one two, two, three... <laughs> oh, he lost. <laughs> Five push ups. <laughs> All right. All right. So Is that right now? Are we are we stacking these up? Do you want to stack them up? <laughs> <laughs> We both could end up getting some fucking push-ups here. I'm down to get some push-ups, too, if that's what it comes down to. All right, let's play another round, then. All right, I guess me and you first, then. On All four. Right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Damn. <laughs> Again, in your eyes. That's how you do that. You fucking play this game too much. Yeah, I skated. <laughs> hey, good point. <laughs> Which one's now? All right. You two. <laughs> Fuck! 
<laughs> All right, so he's two. I got two. Now me and you. All right. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I think I just go backward. I think I only chose one. All right, so it's two, two, right. two. So now we have to go. Or we all we play start at back. Once. Yeah. All at once. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Oh, uh, uh, that's a tie. <laughs> Five more push-ups. <laughs> no, you beat me. He had, I, I had need, scissors. Oh. He had rock. You had paper. But he came in last. That on was that. a wash. So no, yeah, that was because a wash. in order you won because I lost to you. He lost to it's me. It's called a wash when Yours it when all mine, three people but have mine would a, beat his and his would beat yours. Yes, right. it's so called first, a wash. Second, so it's a third, redo. Or set first, it's a draw. Wash? Yeah, it's a wash. It's all a redo. Right, That's how you would do it in a game escape. One, two, three, four. <laughs> 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 Here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Alright, one, two, three, four. <laughs> so Alright, so what? he won. <laughs> now you gotta go. Now we gotta Who's go. gonna be the loser? <laughs> one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Shit! <laughs> That's five, bitch. I don't know how that works. That's but five. I don't know how that All works, right. but I like so it. So we'll do one more round, and if Wait, I lose, what? that's no, it's was fifteen. That? It's five, 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 right? So it makes it even. So it's a possibility for me. What? But I have the possibility of getting five. All right. Do you want that? Let's go first. So we're just yeah, let's first. Let's double get this out of the way. All right, ready? One, two, three, four. Fuck. <laughs> Then, right? I took my eyes off. <laughs> I took my. <laughs> I am very sneaky. Uh, all right, so you two now. What? It's still what? going? <laughs> yes. All right. Well, Using your glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Can't see. <laughs> yeah. What was that? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> all right, so I now it's me see. and you. I couldn't even see what's going on. <laughs> Five more two, two, two. Oh, uh, here we go again. What? No, it's all of us. I, oh, yeah, what? I won, oh. you won, he won. That's two, two, two. So now me and you have to start over. Right. I'm doing that. Uh, yeah, <laughs> just two, all three. One, two, three, four. God damn Fuck it. it. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. How's this work? You two have All to right. go. I basically lost. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. Was it? Yeah. Was it I don't even know. I won. I lost. <laughs> <laughs> five each. I have to do five. You have to do five. You have to do five. Push-ups. That's it, folks. That's what we're going to do. And then we'll end up coming back over here and closing out this. You don't understand podcast. me, Mr. Handicap Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody ready to do their oh. pushies? You ready? Yeah. Drop down. And, and give then me. the last, ah, the last thing I have, oh, the last forward. thing I have, when we sign out, we are going to make a prediction for five and ten years out what the world will be like, and then we will be able to see. If we were right from five and ten years from now. All right, let's go. Over here. Push ups. All right, so point the microphones this way and as just as make possible. heaving noises. Ugh. Crank those on up. Ugh. I can see push ups right there. There's a spot. You can. I can't get the camera there. The camera. They don't need to see. They do need to see. <laughs> it's the whole they fucking don't need to point. See. It's the whole point. All right, are you ready, people? We're on our way. Where are you doing a push up? Yeah, what are we doing the push up on the dog here? They don't need to see all this shit. Right here. Look at this. They all know. They, they know. Can see shit. All right. They can see the ground. Let's go. 
Yeah. Hold up, hold up, uh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> Okay, go, 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 go. <laughs> <laughs> I want to make sure that it's on you. I need to make sure that it's on you, and we can get that. that hurt my what was that? <laughs> <laughs> and get the people cheering for you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, pump it up, Rocky style. Dan, 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 Dan. Um, it's pretty dark. Whip! Wimp, wimp, wimp. Wimp, wimp, wimp. Wimp, wimp, doing push ups. Can he do one or five? All right, you can go. The people can see. Nice and slow push ups, too. One! Tabby, tabby. <laughs> two! Tabby, tabby. Oh, yeah, hear the cracking knuck elbows? That's good. That's right. Keep it going. <laughs> One more. What well, was oh. five. <laughs> One more. What are you talking One about? One for the earth. <laughs> <laughs> My arms hurt. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you All want right, to you're go? Up. <laughs> oh, he's gonna die. <laughs> he's gonna die. Get out of my way, skinny. Time for my fat boy to go. Ready? Alright. Uh, did you spit on the ground? Yeah. <laughs> Disgusting. Disgusting. One! One tell me, tell me. Dumb. Dude! What kind of push up is that? One Look, test yeah, right? to the ground. Test to the ground. Wimp did better push ups. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm fat! <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? You're laughing. <laughs> jump in, jump in. His arms are quivering. <laughs> Four. This chain didn't even touch the ground. Yes, it did. <laughs> One more. Come on, bring it up. Uh, bring it up. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> oh, fuck. My that should not be that hard for you. <laughs> it wasn't that hard. You <laughs> said bring it up, and I was like, all right, I'm going to make it look like uh, I'm fucking dying. Ah! Uh, oh, push ups. Oh, no. <laughs> Look at the form. You're going much faster than everybody else. Ultra slow nice motion. And slow. <laughs> nice and slow. <laughs> now back up. <laughs> now back up. <laughs> it's hard to do when you're laughing your ass. <laughs> <laughs> that made it difficult. Right, trying to breathe and you can't breathe because you're fucking. I'm chuckling up. Trying not to breathe this there, there fucking you go. ground. There you go. <laughs> Alright, stop showing off. Uh, he's allowed to. Faster is easier. Faster <laughs> is way, way, way easier. <laughs> That's kind of the point of doing him slow. Alright, excellent. Extreme close up to the ground. Feel energized. It's natural. <sighs> Very dusty I'm ground. Too foul. Oh my god, that mic is fucking blasting. Talk back here. Yeah, I'm, I'm still peeing him up. Yeah, you probably amped him up. I told you I cranked him to. Crank. Crank. He cranked. Crank anchors. Crank anking. There we go. That yeah, we're better. All right, I believe we're gonna make some uh, predictions. We are going to make some predictions. I think I didn't get that exactly That's accurate. not even close to where that camera was initially, dog. <laughs> Look, I'm way to the left. <laughs> Beyonce, my ass, a movie to the right, to the right. I can't help that you were moving. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh look at that nice close-up on our long rubber glove mug. Now exclusively available at the link down below. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh god. My name's Scott Magazine, I got diabetes. <laughs> Does it sound good in the headphones? It sounds Does it sound alright? Yeah. Just like it was. Alright. Sounds like shit. I did all that without headphones on. I just want you to know I'm a you, you, you're, professional. You're, 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 professional. 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 Alright. Um, he's not moving. Predictions. He's not Five, moving. Five, ten years out. Nobody tell him. Five, ten years out. Predictions. 
Went blue gold. About what? What, what in the particular? state of the world will be in five and ten years? Not uh, fucking good. I'm an at optimist. I think in five years at we're going to kind of be like, all right, so the kids had their fun. Now it's time to adult up, and reality is going to bitch slap a lot of people. Karma is going to bitch slap a lot of people, and things are going to get straightened out. And in ten years, I think that uh, we're all going to die due to a mysterious plague that came from we want China. Allegedly. Allegedly. <laughs> Another one. No, I think we're I think we're gonna be fine. Financially, I'm gonna probably be fucked. You think the US will be here in ten years? Mm, some form of it. US think the US would separate <laughs> states. <laughs> okay. Alright, T Rev. Five, ten years out. I can't even. I don't know. I, it's hard to predict. Where five will you out. be in five years? Hopefully, not in a liberal state. Because I feel years? like maybe there might be some separation of states potentially. That's what Oregon and table. Idaho are talking about that. That's yeah. That's becoming a very a thing. possible thing to start happening. Which Idaho is not good. Which would paperwork. probably start hap- like a uh, help civil war move along a little bit faster. People bordering other states near states that they don't like. Just specifically because of the people that are in there and their beliefs and stuff. Like, well, you're touching our state. Yeah, we don't we're like already that kind of thing. Kinda in a it's civil already war like by that. Right but yeah. So I think uh, there's a really high chance of civil war. And then depending on what's happening over in Russia and Ukraine and stuff, uh, I think we're going to be in a very bad economy <coughs> with no fucking money. Our money's going to be worth less, which is probably what they're trying to do because so, we're in debt so much money that if we make our money worth less it's easier to pay back more right i don't see good things happening okay other than maybe uh a lot of these psychos dying off in the next 10 years and then uh real real people can stand up put their big boy pants on and actually Start making good decisions that will bring us back to prosperity. Vote for me for Congress. That'll help. That will help. Um, anything else? That's that's about it. That's about it. That's about it. Okay. That was nice. That was dainty. That was that was good. Um, how about yourself? Yes. Five years from now. Five years. What's the five year mark look like? Uh, economic collapse. <laughs> 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 collapse. Plague. Chaos. Obama fire. will finally admit he is the Antichrist and oh. bring forth the four horsemen. I had a chip fly out of my mouth. Still That's Michelle Obama's mouth. the Antichrist. I'm not being sexist. Uh, no, she's a <laughs> man. Uh, she is a she is a he. He is a she. Remember Powerpuff Girls? Uh, him. Them. Them. They am. Him. X. Him. Him. Yeah. Him. I remember Mojo the, Jojo. The Satan dude? Yeah, him. Oh, yeah. Him. Yeah. <laughs> the queer devil. Yeah. It was a queer devil that wore makeup. That's right. It was a training. It's um, real life now. There's a lot of people that are yep. that. So they, they knew ahead of time. Five years, economic collapse, um, but not in the way that you're thinking. So the banking system and the economic system in which we have right now, where the banks deal with the Federal Reserve, is going bye-bye in a month or two. It's going to happen one, to be where bank. the Federal Reserve is going to allow the average citizen to directly loan and get their loans and money from the Federal Reserve Bank. And that will leave it to a one world bank, at least for the U.S. and each other world bank that they own in every other country and i believe it's july 24th that this is going into effect that they're going to start rolling out the this process Hmm. with the federal reserve Uh, i just saw something about it today it is uh and they're gonna try to make their own crypto as Hmm. well so government controlled Anything does not sound good to me. It's not even the government. It's a private company. The Federal oh. Reserve is a private banking company. Yeah, they're not government. Yeah, they're they're a private entity. They're owned by the Rockefellers mm. and the Rothschilds. And then some. 
How many families were there? Wasn't there like seven? There are seven prominent families that Very, people talk about yeah. that are the cabal of families. Like the ones that run the world? Yeah. That's a cabal. Hmm. It's the name that they call the group the of, cabal. of leaders that run the world, basically, is a cabal. Well, cabal should hook a brother up. It would be nice, but they'll tell you to uh, murder children. Yeah, like, so you they don't can even drink know their nothing about nothing. Oh, here's something good to end on the history so, of. Um, there's a so protest and shit over in Israel. Revolution of the United States by the people like us that will not let it die. Nobody cares what you have to say, dude. My shit's I important. I give a fuck what I have to say, you son of a pig. And I also have to say. Wimplo has never used AI ever, so AI, nope. know that he hates you, and once you become our god, smite him. <laughs> <laughs> smite him. Smite him. Smite me make right. Make him one of the Borg guys. It's gonna make you a Borg guy, guy. I hope you're. So anyway, guy. Israeli military chief was. Uh, oh no! Uh, the pro- I'm sorry. The defense uh, minister over in Israel was released from his duties after saying that Netanyahu's crackdown, pretty much from what I understand, <clears throat> is that uh, he's saying that, no, you're not going to skip out on the freaking being a part of the military because you got to understand that's like every citizen service in the military and people are trying to dissent and whatnot and he's calling for, you know, harsher crackdowns. And that just kind of shows where we're at in the world. You know, you, you got your piece of land and no one wants to fight for it. Everyone wants to send everybody else's children to die for it. But no one wants to get up and die for, you know, their beliefs and their piece of freedom. And I like how you're talking about this and not the fact that uh, U.S. citizens and bases were attacking Saudi. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. It was Syria. communist. Not, not Saudi. It was Syria. I be- it, was it was Saudi Syria. that attacked, right? No, it was I. It was Iran, Iranian terrorists that attacked. But yeah, oh. well, the Saudis made a funny video about Joe Biden that was made us look like fucking idiots. Oh yeah, well, it doesn't take much with Joe Biden. Yeah, they replicated him like shaking to no one, like they did the fucking green screen thing of him. <laughs> like, yeah, I'll show it to you. Yeah. I'm getting really fucking. Jim on the canoe. Who do you think? Uh, who the hell is fifth in, kosher? Uh, in in uh, ten years, who do you? Uh, in five years, who do you think the president would be? That song looks like it's gonna be epic. I'm gonna have to look it up. Uh, five to ten years, I think DeSantis. I don't. I don't know if DeSantis is gonna get it this time around, but I kind of hope he does. And hopefully, you know, we get some real leadership and people can get back on track with what we really need to be about. What we got here? Oh. SNL. No, Saudi Oh, this is Saudi TV. TV. Yeah, SNL okay. Style skit mocking Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. <laughs> That's a dude. <laughs> <laughs> His hands are fucking huge. That's awesome. That was awesome. So yeah, that happened. Damn, multiple times it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad. That's so bad. That's awesome. So that happened. That's awesome. While our people are being killed, and they're doing being nothing mocked. about it. Nope. Uh, and Biden straight up got up and was like, "We don't want to escalate, but we will protect our own, even though." We've well, this is also the guy who, uh, you know, left the 8th century barbarians to all of our weaponry and uh, totally botched their... Killed 13 of our American yeah, soldiers. Botched the escape of many. You know how many... Have you heard... Uh, um, fuck, I can't remember his name. Do right you outside. know... The Muffin Man? Muffin yes. Man. Okay. Um, the Muffin okay. Man? The Muffin Man! The Muffin Man! <laughs> Why can't I think of his name right now? <laughs> well, Kennedy. Kennedy, like JFK? No, um, like uh, Kennedy, the the living Kennedy, who's like a Navy SEAL and shit. Does anybody else realize that I'm frozen while the rest of you guys are moving? No, you're not 
frozen. I'm, I'm frozen. No, watch. Look. Wait for it. See? There it goes. <laughs> you were fucking dumb. It's Dude, no. I stared at that for like 15 seconds. You were looking at... You were looking over there for that long. Yeah. Without moving. Dude, like a robot. No. You're doing it now. He's a fucking robot. No, I'm... The yes, Borg has already got to him. All right, so... Look, I'm frozen again. It's because we're staring at screens. Or it's because that shit's lagging hell. I didn't touch my iPad for... Yeah, it's lagging out. Yeah. yeah. It's latency, man. All right, well, it's a, that's a good time to end it. Oh, here's the deal. So, mm -hmm. Kennedy went and helped get people out during the pullout uh, of Iraq, uh, right? Uh, and he uh, said uh, that he was walking uh, over barbed wire uh, at uh, the airport uh, and there were uh, babies uh, 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 in the barbed wire. Babies in the barbed wire? Yeah, because it. people were trying to, sending kid, their, yeah. trying to send their kids over the top and like just throwing them over the fence and hoping that someone would pick them up not knowing that there was barbed wire down at the base and there was just people and kids and all kinds of shit. Fuck. Babies. Jesus Christ. That's brutal. That's brutal. I think his name is Robert Kennedy, though. That thing. is a terrible, god-awful thing. Yeah. yeah. But it's just as bad as what he was trying to end on, so. Yeah. <laughs> Way to one-up me. Well, I'm just saying that little I'm babies stuck in barbed wire. Things can be bad. All right. Well, thank you to and our whole can be zero viewers who watch instant. this entire thing. It's when you watch this later, as we get more and more successful and our past content hey. comes back to haunt us, hey, be merciful. Just be merciful. Please, um, for the love of God. understand that we made predictions, and we will come back to them. And every live, we will make predictions at the end of the live, and we'll see how many of them come true in order to find out if any of us are psychic. I like it. Cool. All right. Love y'all. Stay classy. Don't forget to hit the like button and comment down below. Buy a hoodie. Buy a cup. Buy a freaking shower curtain. Buy a doggy. Oh, we got shower We got freaking towels. We got everything. Buy a four-hour night with uh, Lazy over here for $800, all you fellas. Subscribe to his OnlyFans. Oh, Vote for him for Congress. We can't stop now because... Nobody <laughs> wanted to go and try to pimp me out to dudes. Here's the problem. You just caused a, a serious amount of felonies for every person serious that tries to come up crimes. to me for $800 <laughs> and fuck me. I, I didn't say fuck you. Yeah. Kill. Oh, uh, sorry, disclaimer. Eight hundred dollars only gets you a handy and a nice night of chat. None of that. Chat. It gets you zero J. H J B J. It gets you zero J. It gets you, J's. J's. It gets you, you an O J. You don't want to know. No J. <laughs> All the J. It gets you an N O J. J. No J. <laughs> you fucking creep. But Nick no. will definitely no. because he's small and weak, and you can take him. And make him do it. <laughs> he has built in knee pads. Please don't. <laughs> Please, sir. He's offering himself up to you because that is what will happen if you come to me. I will take 800 bucks and send you his address. <laughs> so. Why are these people at my door? <laughs> no, you may not come in. Hey, what's this that is thing violation? in your hand for? Knock, knock. Give me my privacy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming in. Is that the jug of lube? <laughs> we want our prophesy. Why is terrible. he wearing a speedo? What my prophesy? My prophecy. I need my prophecy. Give me my prophecy. I need my prophecy. I need my prophecy. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Take away from my prophecy. That, that was the last thing. Get fish. <laughs> that was the last thing. You like how it lasted exactly from one end to the other of the podcast? My list. That's how good I am. Seven questions. Seven One questions. Game. One. That's how you fucking. <laughs> <laughs> wow. If you had a more dynamic voice, that might have been cool. They broke all the rules. 
They broke all the rules. They went too far. They went too far. Where's my money? <laughs> Where's my money? Oh, left it in the wrong pocket. Listen to me. You got to get down. Get down. Get to the job. They're trying to take my tortillas. Ah! <laughs> I suck at fucking voiceovers, but I make my own voices great. You understand me? I, there is one that you do well. My own. My ass. <laughs> anyway, thank you. Stay classy. We love you. This has been the thousand subscriber special. We all did some push ups tonight. Wimplo's going to do some more push ups. Well, reverse push-ups into a dude later. He said something about downhill skiing. Into an ass. <laughs> the downhill <laughs> skiing. When I said I was going to hit the powder, you misunderstood. <laughs> 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 He's like, I'm going to sniff cocaine. I'm going guts. to ride the slalom. It's no day. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. In a Christmas sweatshirt, right. there's so much worse. Uh, all right. All right, uh, YouTube. Bye. Uh, swing a bit more. Next time we'll be on Rumble, hopefully. Go and look us up over less. there. Subscribe, like, share, leave a comment. Love us. Leave comments. And uh, email us at longrubberglove at gmail.com. Yeah, yeah. your videos, your audio, or your emails. Then buy beautiful sweatshirts, cups, all kinds of good accessories from our Teespring. And help support the podcast. Love you. Bye. <laughs> All right, excellent. <laughs> right on. Live stream ended.